Hey guys, I'm the Gaming Lemon. Uh, my computer that I ordered about three weeks ago from PC Specialist has finally came. Um, you won't be able to see much of my face because, well, my par my brother was supposed to be here to like record the unboxing, but unfortunately, I can't get hold of him to like uh, you know tell him to come around to record it. But uh, anyway, that doesn't matter. Um, it is a custom build of Specs R the i7 3770K processor. I would have got I would have um, gone for the i5, but um, I heard the uh, i7 is better for um, uh, rendering, which is what I'm going to be using it for. It's got hyper threading and whatnot. This is quite a big box. Um, it's a lot bigger in person. I thought it'd be a lot smaller than this. We had a lot of trouble moving up to my home because I wouldn't want to unbox it downstairs. And also my cat is here, which unfortunately does not come with, a com with <laughs> the computer. Actually, I've also got a monitor as well that I got separately, which is the uh, Bank, Bank something, GL245, sorry, like 24 inch. It's quite quite bigger than I imagined. Um, I've been waiting for this like all day, I'm like a little kid on Christmas, and I've never unboxed anything this big, so it's I'm not very good at this sort of thing. But um, you guys really want to see an unboxing, so did I. But um, I also got a uh, 8 gigabytes of RAM. 1600 MHz DDR3, which will, uh, 16 gigs, I guess, would be okay if you're a serious editor, but um, I'm think 8 gigs will be enough for me because I'm not, you know, I'm not going to use it massively, like purely for editing. Is that recording? It is recording. <laughs> I didn't think it was recording there for a second, then I might have to uh, redo it without having the excitement of opening the box. Give me a second, guys. Give me one sec. Ah! I cut myself. Okay. Um. I should never do an unboxing again. Okay, I <laughs> managed to cut myself in the process, only me, with a pair of scissors. And a, that's, that's fine, it's a bleeding a tiny bit, but that's fine. Um, again, I got this from PC Specialist. I'm not going to say if I recommend it, not yet, obviously, because I haven't tried it. So I don't want you guys to start buying it from there. If, I, if you know, I haven't used it properly yet. And this keeps getting in the way, so I'm going to try to fold it, which I probably can't because I don't have a ground power, because... Well, of course. <laughs> there we go, don't want to get in the way. Um... But in about a week's time, I'll post in the description whether I recommend this or not. It, well, it was a very, very good of customer service, I'll give you that. It's very, very well packaged as well. I believe this is the, uh... Okay, I managed to break the handle. <laughs> Good enough, it's got the second handle. Actually, no, that's not the second handle. Crap. Uh, <laughs> I'm not very good at this, aren't I? I wasn't really made out to do unboxings. Um... But yeah, in about a week's time, I'll say whether I recommend the build or not, because obviously I don't know what the quality of the build is like yet. Okay, great, I lost my scissors. Basil, you might have to leave for a second. I think this is the welcome pack, which includes the uh, keyboard and other booklets and CDs for drivers and whatnot. If I can figure out how to open it. Yeah, there we go. I've got the uh, Razer Lycosa keyboard, which um, is probably unnecessary unless you're a legit gamer, but. Once you get one, it looks very nice actually, it looks very well packaged. This is. Okay, I don't have enough room for it here. This is a lot of cardboard. Um, Basil, you might have to move. Basil was my cat, you're wondering. I've got the Razor Light Coast, so not the mirror version, because that'd be a bit weird because I'll be looking at myself every time. I wouldn't be able to stop looking at myself, you know? <laughs> I'll, I'll open that one later. Um, I'm not sure if I should unbox uh, the. Uh, keyboard and mouse in this video. I guess I'll do it at the end of the video, but I know most of you guys want to see the PC, which looks massive, but um, I have to get this stuff out of the way first, <laughs> Basil. My cat doesn't know what's going on and now he's having love, which is fine, because they're taking up too much space. But I also got the Razer Death Adder mouse, which does look very, very nice. I've heard Razer has very, very good packaging, so I'm getting distracted. My cat's just hiding in the corner because he's shocked he doesn't know what's going on. My cat's the worst, by the way. It's, it's, it's normal, it's normal. Um, and here's the welcome pack, which this includes all the drivers, CDs, and uh, what's this for? Oh, this is Multimedia Essentials, which is great. Don't need the full version. Oh, nearly dropped that. I recommend not doing that when you're unboxing this. That's a graphics card driver CD, uh, a motherboard driver CD, 
And I, uh, yeah, I forgot to mention what graphics card I got. Um, the GTX 670. So my full specs is the i7 3770K, overclocked at 4.5 gigahertz, I think. Windows 7 Home Premium. You don't really need to care about this much stuff. The welcome booklet, which I'll be reading as soon as I've unboxed this. Don't want to mess anything up. What's this? Oh, those are like the cases for my like hard drives. I've got two one terabyte hard drives, one for recording and one for other stuff. But I do want to get an S SSD. I don't care if it's faster because you, you pay more when it's got less memory stuff. I don't know what this is. I think this is just spare parts and stuff. Other booklets and stuff, which I. I'm sure you guys don't really want to see booklets and stuff. Other uh, stuff in the case, and I think that's about it. Welcome pack. Um, and of course, other booklets like for the motherboard. But, but about that stuff, this is going to take ages to get out of my room again. I, I just managed to fit this up my stairs. Um, don't know. Oh, this is package. packaging. They package this really, really well. I've heard that the reviews have got very, very good packaging. Um, obviously really securely. Well, I've looked at other unboxings of com computers from other companies and they literally just dump it in there without taking care of any packaging at all. Um, okay, how am I going to get this out? You can see I've got two USB 3.0s, two USB 2.0s, this is just the back. A, uh, two HDMI inputs, DVI output, Ethernet cable, oh no! Four, four USB 3.0s, that's amazing. This is why I'm not very good at unboxing, I'm not sure if you can see the bleeding there. Not too sure if you can see that, but I'm not very good at this and it's already on low battery crap. <laughs> oh, God, that is heavy! Heavy! Oh. oh, it says something on the side, I should probably read this, it's probably important. Hey there. Do not connect your PC until you have read this. Okay, can I connect it now? Oh, no, there's a piece of foam in there that I need to take out to make sure that it wasn't, you know, breaking. If someone dropped it or something, not I did. Well, I didn't really drop it, but... Okay, so I need to take the case off. This is huge! Shit! Oh, how do I get this off? It comes off with, like, um... Two easy pull off things, that's the side of the case. Like those things. Can you see it? There you go, it's got one minute of battery life left. Crap. Okay. I needed to. That was in there. So, I know you guys can't see it, but um, actually, I'll take the case off. No, the camera off. Spin, spin, spin! Ooh, okay, I dropped the camera. Fine. Can you, is it still working? Okay, I've got the TX750 watts power supply, two terabyte hard drives are there. You can't see because it it's not bright at all. Got a fan there, very nice cable management. There's my graphics card, the GTX 670, if you can see it. Oh, it's running out of battery very quickly. Okay, well, that's my unboxing. I'm going to go charge this real quick and then I'm going to set it up and I'm going to come back when it's set up. So I'll see you guys in a sec. Right, so. <laughs> I've uh, finally set it up well ish. It's a lot, a lot of cardboard. I'm gonna have to wait till tomorrow to clear that, all that stuff up because I've got some friends coming in about half an hour and I haven't <laughs> been a very good, uh, good guest or done anything. Um, it took me about 50 minutes to figure out why I wasn't turning on. All I had to do was press the on button, but it wasn't saying it was on or anything, so I didn't know what to do. This thing is massive. It took about three weeks to get here. Forgot to include that. Uh, it should take two, but mine took three because I changed a component in the middle of it, so they had to cancel the component and get a different one. And what's it, what's it gonna do? Oh yeah, obviously, turn it on. Um, so much. Just look at the look at the pit of wires back there, and every, it goes along here as well. Okay, now for the moment of truth, this is the on button. Will it work? Or will it explode? Oh god, it's on. Oh goodness. Oh it beeped. Quite loud, but that's fine. Hey, I can feel the fans. It's beeping again, I don't know if that's good. Oh, uh, please work. No signal detected. Hey look, it's working. Oh! 
Look how beautiful it is. It worked fine. I managed to. Oh. Sorry, I needed to take in to what I'm seeing here. I've never seen a computer on this screen before. Look at the face mask on. Okay, one sec. Well, I was going to install Chrome, but then I realised I haven't got my internet plugged in and I can't really be bothered to um, do that right now. I've got friends over in like any time now, so I'm going to turn off the computer and wait till morning. Uh, I was going to install Chrome or Firefox or something. But yeah, it works fine. Fantastic so far. Uh, it's making quite a bit of noise, but no, it's not heated at all. I, I don't care about noise. But time to put Jim to sleep. That's what I called him. Right, Jim. <laughs> and thanks for watching, guys. If you did, guys enjoy, please do like the video. Uh, sorry for there was no. This will probably be uploaded on Saturday. So sorry that there was no video yesterday. I was doing this, and I thought I would have had time to, but I don't have time to. Yeah, anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Hey guys, I forgot to say one more thing. I just want to say thank you, thank you so much for 75,000 subscribers. Not only that, but you also got 10 million views, which is amazing. To be honest, I never even thought I was going to get to 10,000 subscribers, let alone 75,000 subscribers. Could we reach the ultimate goal of 100,000 subscribers, that, guys? That would be amazing. I've got a massive video planned for that. Um, I just want to thank you guys for all your support recently. This has absolutely been incredible, and a lot of people will be... Um, uh, like pay thousands to be in like the position that I'm in right now and it's just incredible uh, I can't thank you guys enough thank you so much and guys I'll see you guys in the next video thanks a lot guys this is truly incredible and videos should be processing a lot faster now see you guys later goodbye